This is Steph Curry, the five-time NBA All-Star, who's been called the best shooter in the league's history. And this is his likeness on the top-selling basketball sim game, NBA 2K. Uncanny, right? I've heard people say that Steph Curry looks more like his 2K avatar than, well, Steph Curry. That's because of 2K's next-gen character animation, which makes the virtual hoops game feel real. To see how it's done, I caught up with the creators at 2K and Pixel Gun Studio, who turned me into an avatar in the game. I learned just how they capture even the tiniest details, from scoring celebrations to forehead wrinkles, making 2K19 the most lifelike version of the game yet. Half the job of getting a realistic game involves performance capture. It's the process in which a player's movements get translated into their character animations. This happens at the 2K MoCap Studio, a warehouse in Northern California. On the inside, it pretty much looks like a normal basketball court, except you won't find players working out in their normal uniforms here. Instead, they wear these skin-tight Velcro suits, plastic helmets, and finger gloves. All of those covered in tiny rubber balls called markers, which are coated in reflective tape. The markers reflect infrared light back at the 140 cameras inside the studio, providing an outline of the player's body as they dribble and shoot. So it starts with getting them in the suits, getting the markers the right location of their body, building their skeleton exactly, and then capturing those movements down to the millimeter. Every bounce, every shot, every flick of the wrist, we capture every piece of it just to get that authenticity. The goal is to translate each player's signature style. All the techniques, habits, quirks, and little rituals that define their presence on the court. When the NBA talent comes, we're prepared beforehand with a shot list of all the things we'd like to see them do. But what's probably even more important is collaborating with them while they're on site, asking them what's important, what signature moves would they like to see in the game. Those moves can include a player's unique jump shot, a go-to pass fake or crossover, even little nervous habits like nail biting. When you get down to these types of player-specific animations, 2K avatars aren't all created equal. The most elite athletes get the most individualized animations. 2K cover star Steph Curry even had his famous dribbling warm-up scan into the game. Working at the mocap studio basically sounds like the least boring job ever. When we were working with Steph Curry, he brought in Aisha with him and she was nine months pregnant at the time and dropped seven three-pointers in a row. Probably one of the most memorable experiences I've had here. So performance captures what grabs a player's unique movements and puts them in the game. The other half of the equation, face and body scans, which specifically nail down all the details of the player's appearance from their uniform to their facial expressions, even signature tattoos and accessories. To see this part of the process in action, I went straight to Pixel Gun Studio. They work with 2K to collect 360 degree body scans of all the NBA players. And for the purposes of this story, me, baby. I met up with Pixel Gun in LA. My scanning session actually took place in a parking lot of all places. That's because Pixel Gun Scanner is housed inside a self-powered RV, which allows their team to be constantly on the move. These doors contract, and so it comes together so they can travel on the roads. What that means is we can kind of roll up at a site and be ready to shoot in about 20 minutes. This idea to become the first ever mobile scanning studio was born out of necessity. Back in 2012, 2K challenged Pixel Gun to scan the entire NBA, with teams scattered across the U.S. spending less than seven minutes on each player. Prior to 2K14, everybody in the league, and there's I think 450 players in the league, had to be painstakingly modeled by hand. When we were first approached by 2K, it was clear that we had to go to them and we also had to make the, the process as fast and painless as possible. Similar to the MoCap Studio, Pixel Gun's truck is equipped with 144 cameras, which take 144 pictures in a hundredth of a second. Their software then triangulates those pictures to make a 3D model of the subject, capturing up to 16,000 different textures. Their technology is so high def, it's almost unsettling. We have them reveal their teeth, so we're actually modeling the exact shape of their teeth. It's kind of, it's kind of a bummer, I'm going to be honest. Getting that close, and no, 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 no. Variety is the key to showing how your muscles bend and contour in different ranges, which means I had to strike a lot of poses for the camera. Let's focus this. So I'll get the ball, I'll be like. 
This one, you're gonna step outside and the first thing you see is the sun. So you're, you're squinting it down, it's bright. There you go. It stinks in here. You can walk in here and it's gross, man. <laughs> That's awesome. While Pixel Gun does have players perform a core series of poses, their scans also leave a ton of room for personality, which for me was awesome. It's my, it's my Reggie Miller right there. <laughs> I really got into my element. You want to get dunked on that guy? You sure don't. When I sink a three to win the game at the buzzer. What's up? We have people do a yell, like an angry yell a lot, and we actually have them audibly yell because it helps them hit the pose a lot better. Ah! That was good, that was a little clown-like. Let's, okay. let's try a little bit more angry, because I know you have it in you. It's in there somewhere. Let's see it. Ah! Ah! There you go. <laughs> Encouraging the players to express themselves during the scans helps 2K get an appropriate emotional range in the game. We try to get those expressions that are the most unique and the most signature to them. That includes athletes' mannerisms on the court, like Steph Curry's habit of chewing his mouthpiece. We scanned him with the mouth guard in doing that because we wanted to just sort of capture the way that would deform his cheeks and stuff. So we kind of knew we were going to put that into the game and we wanted to make sure we got that moment right. A lot of the NBA players do play NBA 2K. They're always looking at themselves and making sure that their look is accurate. Pixel Gun will re-scan players to make sure their avatars stay current. And when players get new tattoos, they'll often contact 2K to get their new ink scanned into the game. But nothing is as important as the sneakers, which, of course, are a big part of the culture surrounding basketball. 2K takes its shoes very seriously. They meticulously look at all the players in the game and make sure that their shoes are exactly right because in that case, it's not just the players that would be upset if they weren't accurate, but the fans. Like, the fans are totally into shoes and they will call us out if it's not right. I was excited to see what shoes they'd give me in the game and how badass I'd look as a professional hooper. A few weeks later, I was able to see my digital doppelganger for the very first time. Let's see if this works. All right. <laughs> what am I wearing? <laughs> I love that tank top. Can I get that? Oh man, that meme mug. Dave, you seen this? Check out your boy. That's very generous. Yo. <laughs> I've never been that pumped about anything ever. Ever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whose arms did they use? Mine. <laughs> Sorry, no, I mean. What does that mean? No, I mean, like, yeah. like basketball, playing, dancing, smirking Joe. The most unbelievable thing about all this is that I'm wearing a tank top. Overall, I'm very happy with how these turned out.